My name is Cindy Finelli. I do engineering education research. In this space, I apply research methods that are most commonly used in social science to study issues relating to teaching and learning in engineering. One unique aspect of my work as an electrical engineering faculty member doing engineering education research is I get to teach a variety of courses. And I really enjoy the opportunity to engage with these students and to use evidence-based teaching practices to really help them get excited about their learning. One current line of research that I'm engaged with has to do with studying uh, the academic success of engineering college students who have attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. More specifically, we're trying to identify classroom teaching practices that faculty might use to best support the academic success of students that have ADHD. I'm also engaged in a line of research looking at students' sense of social responsibility and how we can better prepare students for some of the ethical issues they might encounter in the workforce. Um, I'm working with some colleagues to design some modules about ethical issues that we can introduce to the circuits curriculum. So by introducing students to some of the socio-technical implications of their work early in the curriculum, we can better prepare students with tools that they can use to intervene on behalf of the public when there are some potentially negative societal implications of the engineering work in which they're engaged. A lot of my research is really about aligning students' technical competencies with the professional skills they'll need in the future. And this is really exciting for me because it's becoming more and more apparent in society and in the workplace that these professional skills are really an integral part of a student's long-term career. I also think that the ability to help faculty use more inclusive teaching practices and evidence-based teaching practices has the chance to really transform what we do in engineering and in engineering education. Having more diversity in the engineering workspace means having more diverse solutions around the engineering design table, and that means uh, better solutions for the grand challenges of the future of engineering. Thank you.